Hey, what's up guys? Okay, so I'm doing this recording over so I don't really know what's happening. Basically what you do is you get your scrap metal and your iron ingot or whatever else you're duping and you put them both on your hotbar so you have them both on your hotbar. You need at least one iron ingot and at least um, say, an, an, say an iron ingot is three to make, you need to have four on your hotbar because you always need to have at least one scrap metal on your hotbar. Um, so basically what you do is you make a bunch of iron ingots and once you make them, you drag them on top of the other iron ingots and your scrap metal will reproduce itself. This works with like spike traps. Uh, I haven't really tried it with anything else, but it works with spike traps, it works with this, it works with like fences, you know, whatever you want to build. Um, everything works uh, that you dupe. Uh, the only thing you can't do is if you try to split it in your inventory, you can put it in your inventory, but if you try to split it, it'll go back to down to like one or two or whatever you started with. So don't do that. I'm sure if you put it in a chest and take it back out, it'll remain permanent. But thanks for watching, guys. Like if this helped you out a lot. No one else has ever discovered this. Um, subscribe for more 7 Days to Die content and lots of other uh, gaming content. You can go check out my channel. And I'm out. Later, guys.